And hello everyone, Greg Scott Bailey here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to Jack of All Trades. We're now on day four, so I'm uh, boiling up some water. We went to fill up uh, all the water we could in that gulch. Um, I did spend points on, um, go ahead and show you, there's the morning chime. I uh, spent points on, where did I spend it? <laughs> uh, cooking. Uh, we did Master Chef. put one into that. I uh, put one into parkour and one into flurry of blows since we're using this b this baton. I wanted to say stun baton, but it's just the regular baton. <laughs> uh, so we got one in that. Um, I considered machine gunner. I think I'm going to do that next um, next time we level up. Just so we're getting just a little more damage done with the uh, machine gun when we're out, out and about with it. It's a pipe machine gun, but hey, it's a machine gun nonetheless, right? So I did make some more... Um, Iron arrowheads here. Where is the feathers? Okay, so that'll give us some more arrows uh, in our inventory. Did some organization. Yeah, we still only have, yeah, 46, 762 rounds. Um, we could always switch over to 9 mil and make a, uh, a pipe pistol. But yeah, we're going to see how this goes. Uh, I've got... Six minutes of wood left. I think that's enough for that clay. Uh, forged iron. Um, I wanted to make some of that because we still have not gotten any repair kits. Uh, so repair kits are still duct tape and forged iron, right? So right now, nothing I have needs it. But we, we made it so that, um, you know, if we need to, we can put it together. We got seven glues. Uh, cloth is in a plentiful supply, but we haven't been really finding duct tape anywhere. So see how it goes. Uh, since it is day four, um, one of the uh, the concerns is that we're going to be coming up on a horde night soon. I'm pretty confident we'll be able to put something together. We got cobbled down here in our own base that we could shovel. Oh, did I ever get this barrel? I did not. Hey, more murky water. Okay, but yeah, we got everything else. Cool. Uh, but yeah, we'll want we'll want to pick a spot to do a horde base. Um, I'm thinking we'll take over a POI and just go from there. Um, could have fun with that marketplace over there, but I don't know if I want to lose all that loot uh, lootable area. In the back, just so mean, aren't I? Um, so this is one. This is cool too. Here, by the way, if you guys haven't seen like these gulches. All oh, right, spider zombie. Where's he at? There he is. Oh, the stop sign. It stopped, it collaborated, and it listened. Yep, take all your anger out on the street sign. All right, so not bad, not bad. Get at least a couple. Uh, but yeah, the cool thing about these these gulches and, and sewers and, and systems like that is some of them connect, some of them have uh, stuff. And I, as I'm saying that, I didn't even realize this one had a... Oh, there we go. I didn't realize it had a little thing here. So what happens is, is this right here, <clears throat> if this section had connect connected to something in town creation... Um, that would not be covered up. That would be unlocked, and it would uh, allow access into um, another building through that tunnel. So it's pretty pretty cool that they can uh, can do that. Um, all right. Yeah, pretty sure there's usually at least one or two zombies here. But hey, it's a chance for us to get some beverage and food stuff. Surprised we have, haven't had anything dive out at us. Um, I've got how many lockpicks? Only three left. Yeah, well, I mean, I say only three. We had four. Um, all right, so these are all false, right? I can't remember. Yeah, I've only been in this POI once. It's broken down. Eek. <laughs> Good times. Right. So they want they don't want to break out. Wait, really? Uh 1000. 1000. Okay. I thought it said 10,000. 
I was gonna say, wait a minute here. <laughs> I was gonna say, I heard a bird. Bird is the word. Woo! <laughs> Get our arrow back. Get some more feathers, even though I think I think we're good on feathers for this series, you know, with not having a limitation like bows and blades where we're only using bows, you know, I can obviously uh, use guns again. So we're not going to need more than uh, more arrows than I think really what we've got going on, um, which is like, I think I got like, what, 300, uh, 400 uh, feathers. Speaking of bows, though, still a primitive bow, but it's a better one, right? 32, 37, yeah. Uh, there's a stone sledgehammer, but you know what? I'm going to scrap it. Sledgehammers are my, my thing, but we're trying the, we're trying the baton. I, again, I want to say stun baton. Uh, okay, backpack. A level 3 bow, but... It does 34, so let's just scrap it. Uh, drop down. Another janitor cart. Okay, we already checked that. Did we check everything in the office? So we know we have a safe here, but do I want to bother with it? Um, I don't know. Probably not now. Probably want to save the, uh, the locks for later. Uh, no lootable shells. Uh, they probably don't make these lootable because it's exposed to a collapsed area. Okay, just, uh, I mean, probably a little bit longer time there than I uh, anticipated, but... Um, there we go. Okay, so, but that did delay us enough or give us enough time to... Wait for the trader to open. Great what you've made my day. Pipe bombs, hex yes. Your payment. Hex to the yes. Okay. So um we've got some tier twos. Now there's a um night quest. Let's it's hard for me to read that. I was like, this is the And we leveled up. Cool. Um four hundred and eighteen. Okay, so yeah, our Holding that knife was blocking, or I couldn't read what the distance was. Um, okay, so yeah, you can go to previous tier and and next tier. That's that's pretty cool. Um, let's hold up on doing a night only. Uh, I'm gonna do a fetch, or no, no, clear household Victorian. I can't thank you enough. Everything that's just close, we we could just knock out quest after quest after quest because. The deal with this right now is that we're going to have to level up, you know, as fast as we can and get points as fast as we can. Now, the hard part about that is we level up fast, zombies will level up too, right? You know, there, there's that catch-22, but uh, I think we can handle it. All right. Take some cobble and... Uh, and some uh, more frames. We got a lot of frames. We're sitting on 98. Oh, I complained about not getting duct tape and loot, and now we get it. All right, so this is a household Victorian, so all this other stuff is just kind of uh, other POIs nearby, I'm guessing. That's pretty cool. Um, oh, I know this one. We we temporarily uh, shacked up in this house for uh, a Twitch integration game. That. Yeah. Okay, let's jump right in. It's clear quest. I think we should be able to uh, knock it out fairly decently, I think. So one of the reasons I uh, wanted to put a point into parkour, at least this early, is because of the uh, moments like this where I'm dropping down places like this. Now they got the mattresses you're supposed to use, apparently, but... Um, yeah, that's that's one of those situations where I was like, oh, okay, let's 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 get at least one point to parkour so we don't even worry about it at, at all, you know. Uh, is there usually a dog here? I can't remember. 
feel like there is. It's going to blink into existence. Oh, there he is. TIE Fighter Death. Rut Row Raggy. Bill's going to be the toughest, so... Get damage on her. Oh, but she's the one that hits me. I say Bo's the toughest, but she's the one that hits me. My goodness. Uh, let's see, I don't think there's... Anything there. Oh, we'll take that arrow back. Thank you very much. I'm not going to worry about slicing them up for rotting flesh for now. We, we get it from the dogs and the birds, but um, if we can remember the, the corpse blocks, those seem to be just quicker and more efficient. Yeah, I could be wrong. There we go. You know, it just occurred to me we also did did not put a point into archery. Ooh, that dude lost his head. So, um, by not putting a point into archery, I think we're, we're missing out on some damage early on, too. But I don't think we need to put more than one. Um, I think we, we just want the damage to count now. But until I see something otherwise, we, we don't need to worry about it later. Um, if I do stealth stuff, I'm hoping to work towards getting silencer uh, for pistol and, and do stuff like that. Um, okay, it's a nice, soft, romantic glow into the room. Are they going to break out there? That's a yes. That's uh, a regular hit. Power hit. Plus a bow, plus others. Another bow. Let's go ahead and go loud a little bit. All right, no more red dots, so that's good. So this is cool. I don't know if this was way it was before, but it's a work, it says working stiff tools on the coffee maker. I don't think it was that way before. Uh, here's the other thing. Uh, we're actually full <laughs> of items already. Uh, let's see that. Let's get rid of that. Again, we'll find more brass later. I just, I, I'm confident of that. If we're going to need it, we'll find it later. Knock, knock. So I feel like Flurry of Blows should be helping him with this, but uh, we'll see. Another shirt with blue dye. Uh, let's go ahead and... Oh, no, wait, that's purple. Never mind. Let's just scrap it. <laughs> We're not the purple person. That's the other guy. <laughs> All right. Sandwich roulette. Score. Nerdy glasses. Look at that. Okay, so XP gain for ner nerdy glasses. So... I mean, we lose a fortitude bump, but um, I don't. I don't know if uh, like like in this case, nerdy glasses gives us a XP bonus, uh, and it well it gives us an intellect bonus as well. But um, I just uh, just not sure if having glasses with the jack of all trades rules that I'm putting together here. To me, it seems like uh, it wouldn't matter that you have a, a plus one in the category because you still can't spend 
more than you're allowed to spend, right? So. Yeah, it's a way to think it through, right? <laughs> oh, well, hello. Ah, just missed. That arrow hit the wall, though. Oh, that one. Oh, hi! You came right over to me. Uh oh. Oh. Got our first infection. And I heard the click. Let's get our two arrows from over here. Yeah, that one and that one. They slight. They have a, like a slight orange tinge. Uh, some people say pink. I see orange. But uh, point being is that there's <clears throat> just a slight sliver of a, a, a line that the uh, the arrows show now. Whatever they're stuck into. Uh, ooh, iron sledgehammer schematic and a bunch of gas. Uh, can't complain about that. Oh, okay, so a level six baton. Uh, let's grab that. And let's go ahead and uh, make use of that sucker. Um, yeah, it's plus 5.6 more than our, our other one. Plus, we're going to put the uh, mod on it, so good times. All right, and does this sell for 14 dukes? We'll just scrap. All right, I'm going to scrap the tough guy glasses. I, I'm back to my old ways <laughs> where I'm not worrying about the other glasses. It, it's still handy, though. I, I, I do think and feel that way, but... Uh, let's eat, drink, and not worry about this chrysanthemum. And then Savage Country, let's see what we've got. Oops, almost one hit too many. Uh, okay, so that should be an upgraded arm piece. Um, there we go. Modify. Get that out. Modify. Again, I know I'm weird how I do that. Um, let's take that. We don't... Uh, you know what? What if we need to make wheels? If I keep, if I turn away coal now, uh, let's try, drop the coffee, keep the coal. I know I'm, I'm turning away coffee, but oh, nice. Um, but my theory there is that we're gonna just keep finding jars of coffee instead, or we could buy it from the vending machines. Uh, ooh, shotgun turret schematic. Now, again, since we are not. Let's go ahead and scrap that. Um, since we are not worried about, um, you know, it's not just bows. We can use any weapon at this point now, right? So um, the sooner we could actually get to electrical, the better. And we could start putting up uh, shotgun defenses on our home base. And depending on the... Um, the, the Horde Knights that we're going to have that'll determine if we're going to actually do um, turrets on a uh, Horde base as well. Oh, that's 5,000. Wow. Just need to sneak out here. This item needs repairs. Each day is a blessing. Indeed, is good sir. Indeed. Ooh, level 2 Iron Sledge. We don't have the ability to use it though. Like like uh, we'll we'll eat up our stamina. Uh, so first aid kits I think are, are a little bit more valuable right now. Uh, let's put the cornmeal here for now. Complete. Let's see your inventory, please. Um, I thought I had something to sell. I stand corrected. Sorry, I didn't have what you needed. Come back soon. We restock Let's put often. A couple things there. I want to keep the cornmeal. I, I'm the guy that keeps the cornmeal. So, um, oh, you know what? We haven't checked his new inventory. It's day four. Uh, so let's go through. Oh, he's got lots of concrete. <laughs> and we are infected, but oh, you know what? We got honey on us. We'll eat that here in a moment. Um, Oh, this sticks to dynamite. Oh, an AK-47 this soon, huh? Does 40 round or 40 damage. This does 41. But it's an AK-47. It's not a pipe gun. 
Oh, airdrop. Okay, so let's come back to this Thanks in a second. Oh, no, it's an airdrop during... Okay, we see it. We see it. All right, let's do what uh, Ja Oodle does here. Um, airdrop scene, right? And that looks to be... Maybe out here. <laughs> drop question mark now this one we'll we'll go and look for right after we're done with the trader here um i really like his technique on that so it's uh we're gonna use it uh inventory uh so we were what armor i just got steel chest i don't have the money for it. i got oh I should sell the, the cash that's what i could have sold uh, he's got a puffer coat. I think we'll find one. A foregrip mod. Yeah, let's get one of those. Um, and I think, I think we will hold off and not get the AK-47. I don't know why. Something tells me to hold off on that. Um, oh, well, would you look at that? He's got mini bike handlebars and mini bike chassis schematic. So I'm going to get the schematic now, and we're going to want to make 4,525 Dukes, 4,425 Dukes, um, to get the mini bike handlebars. Hot damn. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and read that, make sure that we don't uh, <laughs> miss out on that opportunity. Uh, let's put that foregrip on there. Um, don't forget to reload it. And don't forget a jar of honey. <laughs> okay, so we need a new job. Uh, let's take one south. Again, it's knights. Let's do it. I like you, friend. So this means that... We're gonna have to do stuff at. We're gonna have to do some of our episodes at night, right? Co Country Town Business Seven. Wait, is that the same? I can't thank you enough. One. No. Is it the same one? I can't remember. Well, I mean, we'll, let's go find out. But we can't do it until nighttime. Okay, so this one is Maggie's Corner Cafe. Okay. And that's the one we did. The dead rooster is what we did over there. Uh, let's check real quick to see how close we were on the airdrop. Um, I can't get through here, can I? <laughs> Alright, so we're coming up on my X. Um, I don't see it, but what I do see is an Uber Meats delivery. Alright. All right, so I see the uh, the smoke here, but this is not, I think, at all where I thought it was. <laughs> um, oh, and the smoke does go away once you get close to it, by the way. Um, we no longer have the uh, blinking light and smoke forever until you pick it. So let's see how way off I was. Oh, yeah. Well, I could see the line that I was trying to do. Okay, the line was at least decent. Okay. What do we got? Uh, some cord bread. Um, and then food bundle. And I'm out of space. The final frontier. There we go. Okay, now let's take it. Uh, so food bundles. These bundles you get uh, when you open them. They give you stuff. So I just got 10 stews. I, okay. I'll definitely take it. Because <laughs> the stews really uh, fill you up. Um, let's go empty everything we've got and we can, um, work on stuff at the base in the meantime, because we need the, uh, the nighttime to be active to do this quest. Okay, so we're back at the base. I emptied everything out, uh, what we had so far. I put the iron in there. I put the meat stews in as my main meals. Might as well take advantage of that. I do have a couple things left in the bike. Mostly medicals. Um, so, yeah. So what we're going to do is now switch what I usually do. 
which is nighttime work. I'm going to do some daytime nighttime work right now, and then we'll um, jump over to the... Uh, you'll, well, you guys will see it instant here in a moment, uh, but I'll be jumping over to the um, nighttime quest. Uh, but we did at least level up once. We're close to leveling up again. Uh, so one into archery, and then... Yeah, one into machine gunner will be our next level. Okay, so real quick here, uh, just tried to uh, level up by clearing out some of the stuff here. We got a whole bunch of cobble and uh, cement in our own base. So just leveled up and said I was going to do machine gunners. There we go. Uh, so one point in machine gunner, one point into archery. That'll lead us into tonight's work with that. Um, I also started to make a bunch of spikes. I think I made eight. Uh, yep, eight total. So more spikes. Or at least the first set of spikes. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. That was kind of a guess, and lo and behold. Uh, so that's just to uh, to start doing that. One of the things I'm about to work on here now. I mean, you got to make a path to here again. Um, you know, we may want to keep repairing that. It looks like we can upgrade it too. Uh, this is done. Yeah, we're gonna leave that for now is uh, I'm thinking about what if I make myself a uh, entryway here, I think. Yeah, let's do a ramp. I don't think we're going to accidentally fall down, but uh, <laughs> just in case, we'll just do this right way. Man, there's so many blocks now. I love it. Okay, ramp. Here we go. Watch out for that hoodie. Oh, so these must be half blocks or something. Um, okay, I, I can connect me here, right? Yeah, then we get up there. Perfect. All right. So one thing I was going to do is go ahead and come over here just a tad bit early. See what we got to deal with here. Going to be a dog in there, I bet you. Uh, all right, a couple things here, and it's gonna be a, a power quest, so there's gonna be some sort of generator or something we're gonna have to power up. Um, what's this one called again, though? Country Town Business uh, 07. Okay, I think that was that one, Country Town Restaurant 07. I felt like they both had 07 to them. Um, let's do a quick little perimeter check here. Maybe check out some loots. Um, now I moved uh, some items to the bicycle uh, just to clear out the uh, inventory. Don't need the shovel. Um, we put like our repair stuff there. Stone, you know, for the ha the what do you call it? The pickaxe or not pickaxe? <laughs> the stone axe. Uh, the pipes also, but I'm feeling we'll, we'll find more pipes too. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and take a peek. Maybe if it lets us. Oh no, it's bent. So some of these ladders now have these like curved designs to keep us from actually climbing up them fully. So there's another ladder over here, right? Oh, look at that power meter. Oh, what's this? Oh, right, right. Fishing weights. Okay, this one's also bent. So we're not allowed to go up the uh, the ladders. All right, all right. I see how it is. So I put the wrench in here as well. I'm I'm gonna go ahead and just wrench the car. Figure why not? You know, get some of these items. Um. How long would it take us to get through the fence? Again, I think there's going to be a dog in there. See, so at the very least, one. see if I can loot one of the cars. Hey, with pickaxe. Now, we have a level one pickaxe at home. This one I'll go ahead and use real quick see if we can get through this faster. Oh, much faster. So, yeah, they definitely nerfed uh, stone tools. But... Makes it more beneficial when we do get to, uh... Yep, there he is. 
Oh, multiple. The way they move now, it's interesting. Like, he was shuffling back a little bit. Alright, so we know we're going to have a couple, a couple dogs here. All right, so we got ourselves a, uh, a level one fire axe and a level one claw hammer. Uh, I like it. Yeah, we could wrench these apart, but I'm not as concerned. Um, yeah, I just wanted to gauge that out for sure. We knew that we were going to get something like a, a dog or a, um, in that case, two dogs. Um, so we don't need some of this stuff on us. Uh, pipes will stack. There we go. Okay. Uh, we are getting closer. Uh, this is going to be nighttime. Zombies can run. <laughs> so we want to be prepared. I'm going to take a risk here and I'm actually going to move my stun, or not stun, the baton to the number one slot. We're going to move. Our weapons are now one through four. Starting with melee and number one. Creepy music time. Okay, let's do this. Oh, that's so creepy that power goes out. Um, oh, that's why the dog corpses are still there. Oh, yeah, remember that helmet light we got? <laughs> uh... Good times. That's corpse block. Corpse block. Oh, is that cloth uh, in the way of where we go to next? See a switch. Can we get it? Oh, there's two of them. Yeah, we wanted to get Zombie Bow out of the way because he's tougher. So good for us. Nice. Okay. So that opens up that. It's like, that is a legitimate cooking pot, not a mine. <laughs> okay, I think there's somebody back here. Another zombie bow. Can we get... Our weapon switched over in time to <laughs> get the shot, and we did. However, I did alert somebody else. Bummer couple somebody's yeah, it does sound like a big guy now these doors are locked so even though you pushed a button to open them they still won't count he's still up Damn, I was going to say, hopefully that didn't alert somebody else, but it did. Alright, as long as we don't wander too far. Hey, why don't I just open up things that make loud noises? <laughs> okay, let's make sure we're reloaded. times. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, so there's the generator, but let's make sure that all the zombies are clear. Because we may have to uh, 
press and hold down on it for a while. Can't tell if that's a that's a corpse block. All right, so another one down there. So there's gonna be two different generators. So this one seems to be the easy one. So when you press E, you gotta wait for the meter to go. So that woke up others. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, so we're good to go on that generator, but that's now woken up zombies. They can't get up here though, right? That's fine. There we go. Let's make sure they don't blow up the car that I'm standing on. Oh! I was like, where is he? He's a zombie, so he must be behind me. And sure enough. Some others. Where are they at? Uh oh. Click's not good. Yeah. With at least one point in machine gun, at least we get a little bit quicker reload. Alright, clear areas is check marked. Uh, next generator is over here. Oh, loot drop. Gotta do it again. And there we go. Return to Trader is now active. We are good to go on this quest. Uh, we'll go ahead and loot other stuff. So I, I, I dig the, uh, the generator quest. It, it does add to more stuff that we get out of this uh out of these jobs you know it's it's giving flavor to what we're doing here now um in the apocalypse we're not just clearing the zombies we're not just fetching a satchel but but yeah now we're we're getting more stuff and i like that um let's get that okay toolbox there's a wrench not that it's imperative but um we can Let's see if we can get a engine. I can't remember if these give engines anymore. I feel like I feel like they weren't when I was doing it in the uh, the Twitch integrated or not Twitch integrated, but the uh, uh, my Twitch playthrough. Oh, that's convenient. Wait a minute. What about the dogs? So were they not active in this? Ooh, pumpkin seed recipe. Okay. Um. Level 5 pipe shotgun is better. So let's switch over to that. Modify, get that shot back. Let's reload, make sure it's good to go. Okay. What do we got? See, I forgot, I again, as usual, that I moved my uh, tools and weapons around. But I usually hit a stage of the game where I want to do that, where I want my uh, weapons to be in a certain spot, my tools to be in a certain spot. Um, and for whatever reason, I just I like to change that at a certain stage. Car bar, it's okay. Bicycle handlebars, maybe we'll make an auger later, who knows? So that'll be handy. Is that something on top of the tire? Yeah, it's not registering if so. Uh, what else we got here? Wait, so is this two different buildings? Bookshelf here. Art of mining. Um, nice. 50% less damage from falling items. Always. 
Always a good one for me to have. Oh, look at that. Good bunny karma. Thank you, Mr. Bunny. Yeah, there's a switch here. There are dogs. But they're not part of the uh, quest, huh? Interesting. Ah, they gave us a sprain. Okay, so I can't run. We'll have to make sure we bicycle slowly back. Um, great. <laughs> But yeah, so that, that'll uh, do it, I think, for day four. Um, again, it definitely switches up. Oh, another, another hammer, I'll take it. Definitely switches things up as far as doing a series now because now we have to think about um, if we have to do nighttime stuff, um, how I'm going to film and record uh, these things. Let's see if we can cheat. And... It's angry that I'm jumping. Screw it. Let's, uh, I'll take the long way home. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, definitely, like I said, it, it, it's a, it's a different train of thought now that I, um, uh, I can't, uh, can't do everything during the day for the series and we'll have to do some stuff during the night. Granted, we do that with Horde Nights too, so it's not really that, um, that big of a deal, right? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, thanks everybody for stopping on by. Um, if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe and uh, hit that bell notification if you want to get alerted every time I, pop, I post new videos. Oh, this is taking forever. Um, if you uh, like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Help us with that algorithm there. And uh, post in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts. Um, I can already see that this is going to be um, somewhat of a slow, long process because of all the, uh, the the time that we're gonna have to take to put points into, um, but at the same time, there's something intriguing about the whole taking your time on spending points process that this is giving us. So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, where we can go with this. Uh, who knows how long we'll be able to do it because of the uh, experimental version, uh, but um, I look forward to, to trying anyway. So, thanks again, everybody for stopping on by, and as always, we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye-bye. What you think, what you think about When you're born into a fire Let them burn, let them burn it out Sell them to the richest fire They want to let the world decay They tell us lies We won't let the world burn